Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 13. In the last episode, we uh, finally got all the party members connected. Uh, Snow is Sarah's fiance. Sarah is Lightning's sister. They were all looking for Sarah inside the vestige. And stuff like that. And uh, Hope and Vanilla was just along for the ride. Uh, Hope still thinks that Snow killed his mom and he, he wants to tell him off. So there's a bunch of stuff that's happened. We were all finally together. And now we have a date with the foul sea. And of course, there's Sarah right there. But we have a date with the foul sea. See what we can do about getting Sarah back to normal. But right now, there's not much we can do. So with three party members, this is actually going to be a lot easier. There we go. So now we got a date with the foul seed. We have, we have a new foul seed too. There's, you know, there's a flying foul seed. We actually have a... It's called a white. So, everybody's starting to go out to the Pulse Style Sea. Sarah, oh, Snow wants to get Sarah, Sarah back to normal. Lightning wants to just figure stuff out. So, like that, so. And okay, again, Vanilla and Hope's just along for the ride, so. Oh, I could've just, if I would've known that, I could've, there's a save point right there. Oh well. Stupid, stupid uh, controller. But with three people, it makes these battles a lot easier right now. Alright, anyway. Alright, let's say... Is there any new shops or anything? No? Okay. And what we got over here? We have... Five potions. Okay. I should tell you that something big is about, probably about to happen. So now you finally get to see what the Pulse Falci looks like. Falci. Yep. And this Falci has a name, is a summon. Basically, you'll know what the name of Falci is. You'll recognize the name. You gave her a focus, and she did it. You got what you want. Now let her go! Please, turn her back. I'll be on the sea instead! Oh, wow. Fine. You go on begging. Like this thing gives a damn what we want! Lightning! Nothing's happening. That fell This thing's fault the brute started. And it's people who are dying. Sarah told us to save Cocoon. That means this thing needs to die. It's reacting. You know what that means. Now we have new boss music. This is new boss music when you fight like Falsies and Espers and stuff like that. Yeah, this is the foul sea. And this foul sea's name is... Yeah. 
You ain't getting out of there, help. Or Come on now. You really think you can kill a Fauci? I'm doing this for Sarah. Or Vanilla and Fight or Vanilla and Hope are not part of this battle because they got cut off. Who else dies? You'll find out about Dodge later. I'm in. As long as you don't mind that. We have somebody who's fighting guns, sword, a gun blade, and fist against a literal god. And his Fauci's name is... This Anima. This is Anima. God bless controller. I don't like this controller. All right, the best thing to do is get rid of, try to get rid of these manipulators. It makes the battle a little bit easier if we can get rid of these manipulators. We'll continue healing. And because you don't, you know, it's, take, it's going to take a little bit to regenerate its arms. That's why I said get rid of the manipulators. Because they just spend all this time to uh, try to uh, try to uh, revive it. And now you can spend all this time welling away. That's why we got all the potions too. There we go. Yeah, Doctor's Code. You'll figure out what that is later. So we defeated Anima, the false fallacy. What is going on here? Probably figuring it out by now. Yeah, Anima is capturing all of us. And you'll see what's about to go. On. We're all about to become let's see. So that our fallacy is gonna give us a focus. We have to complete it before we turn into let's see. And that's basically the, the point of the game. We have to figure out what our focus is and to complete it before we turn into fallacy. I mean let's see. But there's other things to it too, but there's glimpses of the focus right there. This song reminds me a little bit of the Helm of the Face from Final Fantasy X. But, um, we, um, like I said, we have the uh, Lassie the world. Now we all become Lassie. And we did defeat Anima, though. And all the water turned into crystal. But, um, yeah, so, I mean, there's going to be more to it than just that, because it is a trilogy, but, but we have, um, 
Lufaus, but we are becoming a, um, let's see, we have to figure out what our focus is before we turn into Lassie. I just close my eyes and lose myself in happier days. Then I wake up and see you again. Yeah. I save. We still got some more time. This is only... You're about to find out. You're about to find out who, like, dies. This is like day 11 when they, when they found the, um, Falcy. Sorry, I had to fix my controller. But this is how, um... But this is, uh... This is where, uh, like, day 11, where we find, they find the Falcy. And... There's our glimpse of somebody. Yeah, you will have become quite acquainted for her later. Goes. This is the city of Bodom. We'll be heading there later. Alright, so, yeah, this is day 11. This is where, um, they find the Pulse Falci. This is, so this is before wish. Sarah even becomes a Lassie. So about that, so. Maybe I was. I was hoping that tomorrow I could tell my sister. Sarah's gonna play a big part in future She's games. So Yeah, she, actually, I think she's already became a little C because she's hiding it right there under bandages. And see you fulfill their focus. They become a crystal and gain eternal life. Yeah. Would help if they gave you some clue. Okay, so yeah, she's already a little C by now. We'll figure this thing out. You will never be one of those monsters. So what will I be? A crystal? I don't know. They're pretty. I will stand by you. No matter what happens. I'm yours forever. Oh. Sarah. Sarah. My one. My only. Did you marry me? Yes. <laughs> Oh, this is a little, this is a little sweet. Okay, that's a little sweet. But this is, uh, so they're giving you the flashbacks. Like this is, uh, by them, Sarah's already able to see, but this is actually where they find the pulse foul scene. Oh no, there's 11 days. I think there's 11 days after they find Pulse Lassie, because it's right over there. You gotta love these fireworks. They granted my wish. Your wish? Before I asked you to marry me, I wished that you would say yes. Oh. <laughs> then, maybe they'll grant mine, too. What's that? To have the courage to tell Lightning that I've become a Lassie. Hey! Our engagement is way bigger news. Aww. 
Yeah, so this is just a big flashback right now. Oh god. Yeah, Lightning's not her real name. It's, it's a code name she was using while she was in the military. You will find out what Lightning's actual name is later. Pretty song. This is one of the two big songs for Final Fantasy 13. This is like the, the main theme of Final Fantasy 13, and then they got one for the credit scene called My Hands by Leona Lewis. They got, they got hit by a wayward firework. She's scared, understandably. Thank you, Snow. Alright, I'm just making sure my, my, uh, laptop is charging. And it is. Alright. We still got a little bit of time, because, uh, I'm gonna try to make these videos 25 to 30 minutes, so. Because it's still a long game. There's an Xbox 360 game that's across three discs, so think about it. Yeah. Everybody's got. Yep, yeah, we all became Lassie. We all have Lassie brands. Is this. Real? Yes, it is. We're now on Lake Brescia, Cocoon Lowlands. The lake that got turned to crystal. This must be Lake Brescia? Well, I guess we fell from up there. And the lake turned to crystal? Help me out here. I mean, did the Pop C do this? How in the world did we end up here? We don't know. We're alive. How? Sarah. No one survives a fall from that high. Not without a miracle. Sarah saved us. Sarah? Listen. It's all your fault. She got uh -oh. you. Uh-oh. Watch out! As you can see, we got the... Uh, as you can see, we got Lassie. He's got a Lassie brand. All of us turned into Lassie, so... Yep, unfortunately. Alright, so now we got, okay, Paradigm Shift. This is where actually we get a uh, battle of uh, extensions of the battle. Yes, let's view it. You can assign characters the most effective roles for a given situation by changing your party's paradigm. You can switch between paradigms as often as you like. Press, press LB to access your party's paradigm shift. The paradigm roles is, uh, assign specific roles to the members of your party. These roles define the spells and abilities available to a party member, as well as their general behavior in combat. There's a wide variety of paradigms to choose from. Offensive paradigms concentrate on dealing damage to enemies, while defensive paradigms focus on party protection and healing. It's very important to shift paradigms to suit your situation. You can, you can use the directional pad to scan the paradigms available and see the list of roles that each perfectly compromises. 
Your current paradigm of relentless assault is an offensive paradigm in which multiple attackers coordinate your efforts. The two uh, paradigm two ravagers target whichever enemies the commandos attacks with the goal of quickly filling the enemy's chain gauge in order to stagger it. If you wish to continue using the relentless assault paradigm, press B to close the paradigm deck. If you wish to change paradigms, use the directional pad and then press A. We got two paradigms of Ragnall. There's actually a pretty good one right here. One of your party members is just taking damage. Now might be a good time to open your paradigm deck and use celerity. Chosen celerity will cast snow and roll with signal, which is like a tank. And then vanilla will change to medic, which is uh, the white mage. And then uh, commando is basically the warrior. They'll be focusing on a. Uh, Everybody's good right now, so let's go back to the assault so we can get rid of these guys. So, yeah, basically, it uh, completely gauges out and we like, completely expand the um, battle system now with paradigm shifts and different paradigms, which I'll, we'll go over when the time comes. You can even set your own paradigms if you want to. So we really are the sea. Yes. <sighs> Looks like it. You too. Yeah. Right here. Fan service. Okay. We'll see to the last. Why me? I don't even know you. Will you have to go and attack that thing? It's your fault. It's your fault, man. And here's the underneath the braces. Uh, underneath the gloves right there. Oh, this is your upstairs fault. Watch it. <sighs> They're getting, he's getting no sympathy from anybody. <laughs> we have good riddance because Hope's a little bath, a little bitch. Except for Vanille, but Vanille's nice to everybody. But Vanille's nice to everybody, so. Let's see, huh? Yep. Yep. We're all playing for Team Foster. Dialogue updated. Making sure there's no um, treasure back there. What you're wanting. So now we got. So right now she has Commander and Ravager. He has Ravager, Commander and Sentinel. And she has Ravager and Medic. So, really the two that you have right now are probably the best two to use. Right now, for now. But as you get more roles and more party members and all that kind of stuff, you can switch all up. Okay, if we don't know our focus, how do we complete it? I think I saw it. I think so too. So what? That is how a focus comes down, people. The foul see? They don't spell it out with clear cut instructions. All you get is a hazy glimpse. Hmm. How do you know all this, though? Well, you know, that's what they say. You know, legends and all. Hmm. Legends. <laughs> Did you see anything? I, uh. I just. It's all kind of foggy, but I saw this big, I mean, towering. What, what? Wait a minute. I think we all saw the same focus. Come on now. Do we all have the same dream? Ragnarok. What the hell is Ragnarok? Dude, that's the thing about Final Fantasy Thirteen. You get, you get all this stuff and you don't even, they don't even give you explanations for it. Really, you have to look it in the data logs. So. 
What the heck is Ragnarok? You mean that was our focus? Yep. But how are we supposed to know what to do from that? That's the tricky part. The dream's the only hint the Falsi gives us. Figuring out what to do with it, that's our job. Okay, okay. We're a pulse of the sea, right? Enemies of Cocoon. Mm -hmm. So, does that mean that our focus is... Destroy Cocoon. Are we supposed to save her? Say what? Our focus is to protect Cocoon. Really? Okay, and why is that? Because Sarah sent us. Let's do it. We're all in this together. I'm gonna look for Sarah. She ought to be nearby. Uh, and we lose now. And Vanille. Wait! Jeez. That boy can't stay still. So you're gonna be our party for the foreseeable future. And where is Lightning's brand at? Yeah, that's what they're called, brands. Uh. Alright, this is where we, how we start leveling up our characters. Having become able to see the powers of your party can now develop the powers of uh, learning new abilities or improving attributes such as strength, magic, and HP. Yes, let's do it. First, open the main menu. The Crystallium access is available for the menu. Open it up. Character that's like Lightning. There's a Crystarium which allows... Think of the kind of like the Sphere Grid from Final Fantasy X. Lightning can de completely develop as a Commander or Ravager. Each has its own path of development. We're going to start off with... Uh, uh, as you can see, the Ruin Crystal is eliminated. Eliminated Crystal represents represent known abilities. Lightning can use her offensive magic spell Ruin whenever she's playing the role of Commander. Crystal next Ruin is still dim, but by ascending the light of Crystal Genesis to reach it, Lightning can obtain the Crystal and its benefits. You can advance the path of the Crystal Genesis of holding A... Doing so, we can uh, consume CP, so we'll get CP throughout the game, without it. Character development always requires CP. Go ahead and advance Lightning's last uh, path, so boom. You obtain a strength plus four, so lightning's, and lightning's strength increases by four. Attributes can only be used in a corresponding role, by uh, attribute bonuses like this only apply across all roles. At times, you must direct the course of cryogenesis. Normally, the lab will advance until you run out of CP, however, it will stop automatically at branching points like the strength plus four crystal you just obtained. We're going to go this way. You have run out of CP, so Crotosynthesis cannot be proceeded to develop lightning further. You will need to earn more CP. You learn CP after battles. Once you have fought enough, return to the Crystarium to attain more crystals. You can develop other party members to the Crystarium as well. So for uh, Snow, actually Sentinel or Commando won't be a bad idea. Actually, you cannot go any further as uh, as you get further into the game, you'll be able to uh, you'll be able to get a little bit further in um, the Crystarium. More unlock. Let's do. Let's start her off with uh, medic. Now you can also do uh, Hope and Saz if you want to. For uh, You can only do Ravager, so Ravager it is. And then Hope can only do... For him, Synergist would not be a bad idea. Now you, synergist is like Protect, Shell, stuff like that, so... Doctor's Code restore, uh, doubles the po uh, effect of potions. And we get Sarah's too. And we'll look at uh, next episode when we begin, we'll look at the data log. We need to find a way out of here. We can worry about everything else later. Let's get to a save point, which is right over here. All right, we're going to end it here, guys. When we come back, we need, uh, we need to uh, hunt for Sarah. And uh, we're going to look at the new... Sh uh, 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 let's look... Okay, before we end, let's just see if there's anything new in the shop real quick. 
And then we're gonna look for Sarah and get through this Lake Brescia now that we're seas start kind of trying to gain. Start to, to, all right, so we can buy power wristbands and magician's marks now too. But anyway, we're gonna end it here. When we come back, we're going to continue looking for Sarah. Sarah, we're now at C. We gotta figure out what our focus is and all that kind of stuff. So have a good day. I'll see y'all next time. Well, let's play Final Fantasy 13. This DKS3 is a crazy gamer. Signing out.